At this hour, Baltimore City Police are looking for the gunman who shot and wounded seven people in a single incident. WJZ is live at City Police Headquarters right now. Rachel Carden has Mayor Young's message to the public about this. Rachel? That's right, Denise. This morning, Mayor Jack Young said that hospital beds right now are needed for people infected with COVID-19. He said senseless shootings have no place at this troubling time. A night of intolerable violence. We will not stand for mass shootings and the increase in crime. We will not stand for this level of violence. A suspect opens fire Tuesday night just before 6.30 in West Baltimore. Commissioner Harrison says the shooter had a semi-automatic assault rifle. Seven victims who were shot last night in the Madison Park neighborhood. All seven victims, including a 17-year-old, are in serious condition but stable at this time. A police officer in the area returned fire at the suspect. Our officer was not armed with the level of deadly firepower that this individual had. The officer did discharge his weapon, but it is unclear at this time if the officer struck any suspects. As the search for the shooter continues, Mayor Jack Young is pleading with people to put their guns down. We cannot clog up our hospitals with their beds, with people who are being shot senselessly, because we're going to need those beds for people who might be infected. As concerns surrounding COVID-19 grow, Young says city leadership will not tolerate violence in the streets during such troubling times. Warning bad actors, you will be caught. Commissioner Harrison said a silver Honda was spotted leaving the scene of that crime yesterday evening. Homicide detectives are currently trying to find that vehicle. If you know anything about the car or about the shooting, you're urged to call Metro Crime Stoppers at 1-866-7-LOCKUP. Live in Baltimore City, I'm Rachel Carden for WJZ.